I got you a present. You like it? It's an ice cream scooper. Okay, next Here is Pesanet. Hold to track. Uh, I don't see any shadow. Oh! Where is everybody? Uh, this isn't creepy at all. Hello? Well, this can't be right. It's like everything's on standby. It's like if this it's place is terrifying. Party, they're doing an awfully good job of it. Yeah, it looks like a store over there. Avina! Is that name the same person? We could see what the VI has to say. Avina! Welcome to the Nexus, gateway to Andromeda. I'm Avina, a virtual intelligence designed to assist you with immigration. Uh, can you tell us where the welcome party is hiding? I'm sorry, my code is limited to information and simple interaction simulation. You are useless! Please select from the following pre-programmed <sighs> responses. Uh, um, the Nexus. What is the Nexus? No, no, I didn't want to know what. Oh, God damn it. I didn't want to know what it was. Colonization efforts. It is the first destination for all colonists upon their arrival in the new galaxy. Please enjoy the many venues the Nexus has to offer. As the station expands, it will one day serve as the seat of government for Milky Way colonists. Providing a safe, stable, and prosperous environment is our primary goal. Not from the looks of it. Tell me about the current. I'm done. That's all. It has been my I don't want to bore you guys with all that stuff. One of our helpful immigration staff for further assistance. I would and listen to it all, but I don't want to bore you guys with that boring with stuff because it's boring. Is you. I don't have a bright star. The wait time for immigration processing is unknown error. Uh oh. Right. That was helpful. <laughs> all right. Thank you, Vina, for the uselessnessness. All right, G. Plants are still alive. Good. I'm gonna go over here then. What the hell is that icon it's up like top? They didn't finish building it. I hear it. It's over there. Construction worker. Hey! What the hell you doing? Hello? Don't you hear us, dickbag? We're talking to you. Let's see what's going on here. Hi there. Hi. We're from Ark Hyperion. And. Wondering where everybody went. Did he hear you? Uh... Did you say an arc? What? Is that a problem? This is the Nexus, right? Pretty sure we parked in the right place. And for what it's worth, your VI over there could use an update. Of course, I'm sorry. It's just... We thought you were all dead. What? Why? Or captured, or lost in dark space, or... Raped. But you're here. Yep. You have no idea how much this means. Yeah, we're pretty awesome. I don't believe it. Who the fuck is that? Oh, hi, friend! Garrus. Not really. I'm Tyrion Candros. Hello. I lead our militia on the Nexus. Hola. I miss Terrain voices. I'm Ryder. This is Cora Harper and Liam Costa. Part of the Liam Neeson. team. I'm sorry for the confusion. Our sensors told us an arc had arrived, but Helios is notorious for scrambling equipment. We thought you were just another malfunction. Ah, oh, no, we're here. Well, I've got a shipload of people that says we're here. Of course, it's just... You're the first Ark we've seen. After a year of waiting and no sign of the others, we shuttered this area and stopped looking. You've been stranded for a whole year? Longer. I'll fill you in on the way to Op Center. Please do. Okay. Everything that could go wrong with our plan has. We arrived 14 months ago. Right away, we hit a band of dark energy that knocked us off course. Oh. We're familiar with it. Then you'll know why we call it the Scourge. We lost whole sections of the station. A lot of people died. Oh. No power, no food. The chaos went on for months. It finally led to armed rebellion. When order was restored, the insurgents were banished. Exiles, we call them. Are things back to normal? Not even close. But you're here now, so maybe the worst is over. I'm gonna activate the tram now, so I don't skip your dialogue. No word from the other Pathfinders? No word from anyone, period. Any threats from the locals? So far, we've stayed hidden. We're in no shape to deal with an attack. We had a first contact situation on Habitat 7. Whole thing went south. They tried to kill us. I shot them, though. That wasn't first contact. We know about them. 
Those aliens are going to be a real problem. This day just keeps getting better. Shut up. We're here. Yay. You guys go ahead. I'll check out the security situation. You should know our command structure has been fractured. Some of us are filling in for leaders who died. Mm. Is it true? They said drop everything and report for duty. And no one was expecting an ARC to finally show up. Docking procedures are green across the board. Stand by to merge Hyperion power into the grid. Lady, you need to get a comb. Holy hell, your hair is everywhere. Hello. How you guys doing? The crew of the Hyperion. Yes, it is I. Good luck. Thank you. I'm Jaren Tan, director Hi. of the initiative. Jaren Tan. You have no idea how much your arrival means to us. We're here to help. We've heard about what happened, and we're ready to help. We could use any supplies you have. Nope. Food, water, we're short on everything. No, nope, not happening. You're Foster not getting Addison. my Snickers. She oversees or my Dr. Affairs. Pepper. Where's the Pathfinder? You're looking, looking at, him. at him. Yep. I'm so good at this. You're not Alec Ryder. My father's I dead. Am Scott Ryder, whatever his, his name successor. is. Alec is dead. Yes. Dead. In he the ground. Understand. The entire initiative is at risk. None of the Golden Worlds panned out. They're a bust, and there's been no word from the other arcs. What happened to them? Unknown. Our supplies are nearly depleted. Rationing bought us some time, but even that's running out. We need to find more resources. But that takes people, and we can't wake them up. Until they have somewhere to live. A Golden World. Now more than ever, we need a Pathfinder. I am the damn Pathfinder. To you, Ryder. Are you up to the task? Ah, uh, yeah. I may not have been the first choice, but I'm ready for this. So ready. Youthful enthusiasm will only get you so far in Andromeda. Shut up. That's no way to treat a guest. Is that a woman? I'm so confused. I'm Nak Morkesh, superintendent of this station. I hope they haven't scared you off already. It's nothing personal, uh, but now isn't the time for on-the-job training. She looks, oh, I'm, I'm At least the Pathfinder here seems willing. You don't to look try. like a woman. I'm sorry. We could use a fresh perspective. It's weird. You've heard my concerns. I'll leave you to it. We're all feeling the pressure. Let's have a private word in my office, Ryder. We'll discuss giving you a scout ship. Oh, okay. I'm I love free stuff. The details with your associate. Okay. Welcome to the Nexus. Thank you. Um, thanks for helping me. Thank you for standing up for me there. Mm, hopes in short supply here. What little we can find should have a chance. Ma'am, the Hyperion's core is now online. Oh, you are a woman. Oh, okay. Let me show you something. I mean, it's pretty obvious, but not to me. An hour ago, that was all dark. But with the power from your ship, you're keeping the lights on. You have my vote. And when the power runs out, you'd best go talk to Director Tan. Make sure that doesn't happen. And don't be shy. Come see me when you have a chance. But I don't... I'm still confused as to what you are. Are you mad or woman? This I don't know. You received an objective. Okay. Ah, uh, that's not the objective. Okay, maybe it was. Hmm. Oh. Squad skills. You know what? Auto level up. And auto level up. There. You guys have your own shit. I ain't doing it. Okay. Speak with Tan, Cash, Candrus, and Addison. That's a lot of people. Are they showing up on my map? Nope. Okay. Inventory, huh? Really? Oh, I remember that gun. I think it was called the Valkyrie. Hmm. 
I can destroy stuff? Let's not do that. Okay. Kados, stop it. This is the planet where we landed. Habitat 7. It wasn't even close to livable. That's been true of every world we found. Ryder, we were discussing your next expedition. About damn time. Good. I was starting to wonder who was in charge around here. Director Addison is entitled to her opinion, and mine overrules ours. Does she know that? I oversee the entire initiative, and I have decided to give you a chance to prove yourself. To that end, the score is dealt as a serious blow. Whatever it is, our scientists theorize it's not natural. An artificial energy cloud? It wasn't here when we left the Milky Way, yet it rendered all the golden worlds unlivable. Then there's the aliens you ran into, the Ket. They're Ket. obsessed with alien structures we found scattered around the cluster. They'll do anything to prevent others from accessing them. It seems murder isn't exclusive to the Milky Way. And now the challenge is to settle a world in spite of all that. This one here, Eos. Oh. You need to increase the viability of the planet so we can establish an outpost. Then we can bring more colonists out of stasis. The more colonists we have, the more resources we can gather to support the Nexus. Everything depends on it. There are six worlds we hope to settle. Okay, but you said every planet you found is unlivable. So, how do I... A good Pathfinder would relish the challenge of solving it. I am right. a good Pathfinder. I think I should go check on things. And if I fail, I guess it's no sweat off your back, right? You'll just look for another Pathfinder? Placing bets on people is part of my job. Some of them pay off. Others... Yeah, just tell me what to do, man. I, I'm not gonna sit there and play this damn dick pissing game with you. Just point me to my ship and I'll be out of here. They're prepping it now in the docking bay. The coordinates for EOS will be in the computer. And when you have a moment, we should discuss the missing arcs. I was wondering about that. Ah, my brain! Ow. Something wrong. Yes, yeah, Sam just burned my brain. Ryder, can you see me and Sam live on the Hyperion? Your implant needs attention, and we need to discuss a confidential matter. Oh, no. okay. I'm fine. So did I still ask him about the thing? Tan! Ryder, you have my condolences for your father. Oh, thank you. I appreciate it. I didn't know him very well, although I understand he played a key role in planning the initiative. I'm sure he'd be concerned that we still have several arcs missing. I'll find them. They're as much a part of the initiative as the human arc. We'll find them. We have to. Tens of thousands of colonists are unaccounted for. It paints the initiative in an unflattering light. Did you have some other business? Uh, no. Bye. That's all. Thanks for your time. I'm happy to help. You will find our futures depend on each other's success. Good luck. Farewell, squishy face. Farewell. All right, then. Speak with Sam in the Hyperion. First, I gotta speak to everyone else. Cash, Kandros, and Addison. Up. Oh. What happened? Hi. Someone just burned themselves over here. Speak with Engineer Patil. Patil. Hey, you okay? Yeah, right, friend. I'm fine. My arms got the brunt of it. Stuff exploding like this happen often? Back right after the mutiny, we had a lot of this happening. Wait, but what not mutiny? Lately. I wasn't there during the mutiny. Lucky. I thought we were done with this, honestly. That maybe I was just being paranoid. Is it paranoia? You know what they say. It's not paranoia. If someone is out to get to you, yeah. Third time this week. It's getting worse. First one was small stuff. This one could have hurt bad if I'd been closer. That's not good. Sorry, understatement. Yeah. And now I have more repairs. Hmm. I'm, well, all this us hurting each other shit's gotta stop. Whoever's doing this has to be stopped before someone gets seriously hurt. That's what I'm trying to do. But I'm an engineer, not a PI. What's a PI? I've scanned all I'll the potential sabotage areas I can think of. But I don't know who to trust anymore. You can trust me. Sounds like a lot went down before the Hyperion docked. Yeah, I guess. Wait, that's it. You can't possibly be involved in this. 
You weren't even here during the mutiny. I already said this. Would you, if, if you have time? Maybe you could help me if they start hitting critical systems. Okay. Sure thing. What can I do? If you could scan these other panels while I fix this one, that'd really help. I've sent the locations to your Omni tool. Just send me the data when you're done. Okay. I will get right on that never. Let's see here. Hello, ma'am. And ma'am. Be careful. What? She's talking to me? What? Okay. I'm going in here now. Hello. Oh, hello, Cash. Yes, I know the. Shut up. There you are. Hope the others haven't been giving you a hard time. No, I'm good. There's a lot that needs doing. At least with the Hyperion hooked up and feeding us power, my team and I can get more work done. So, um, where are the Krogan? I noticed there aren't a lot of Krogan around. You haven't spoken to Number Eight yet, have you? Who the fuck's that? Number Eight. Tan. Oh. Ask him why most of my people left. He'll have opinions. I can tell I you this much. I don't want to talk to him again. When the mutiny happened, a deal was made. My clan were supposed to settle matters and, in return, get more say in the initiative. Did the deal go through? The clan held up their part, but Tan had a meltdown when he found out we wanted more say around here. I'll boo him for him. Then Axon's assistant, Spender, pretended he never made the deal in the first place. What a dick. It was a mess, but I don't blame my people for walking out. We're done being used. Then why are you here? With your clan gone, why did you stay? It's complicated. The station and my clan both need me here. Okay. I'm done, bye. Nothing more for now. Try not to die out there. I will. Die, I mean. Ooh, a container. Don't mind if I steal your shit. Let's see what you have here. A cyclone. Don't know what the fuck that is. But I will... I will equip it. What's a cyc... Oh, shit, I got rid of my pistol. Shit, talking mushroom. Sorry, ma'am. Oh, it's a pistol. I oh, know it's not sorry for. Okay. Mm, let's go over here. And soft chitin. I don't know what that's for. Hello. Oh. Oh. <gasps> okay. What is this? Ooh, there's the falcon. Wait, that's a grenade launcher, I think, isn't it? I don't remember. An Omni Blade, number two. A Katerna. And a Viper. Okay. Let's sell the Avenger. I don't know what any of this stuff for. Is all this stuff meant to be sold? Salvage. Oh, okay. Sell that. Sell that. I'm hoping I don't need all this stuff. So I'll salvage. And confirm. Farewell. Okay, what the hell is all this shit? Oh, okay, that's what it is. Hmm. Okay. I really want to get that shotgun. But obviously I can't get it right now. Oh, but I, I will soon. Let's have a talk, arms merchant. Oh. Weapons and stuff. Oh, whatever. I got you covered. Use the console to take a look through what I got. It'd be a lot easier if nice I eyebrows. Half my stock. Okay. You got it. Shop till you drop. Here I come. That's fine. Hey, wait. Please don't drop anything you bought from me, okay? Okay. Tam would have my head if anything happened to you on my account. <laughs> I think I'm good. Tis. Tis okay. All right, friend. What the hell? That's creepy. What are you doing over here? Oh, it's a prison jail cell. Then. Oh, okay. Okay. All personnel, be aware of Let's see what's going on over here. New location discovered. Sweet. Let's look at the security footage. Damage control. Two tier and Kondros from Jaren to and director. Or Tan, director of the Andromeda Initiative. Kondros. <sighs> As you're aware, there was a mutiny aboard the Nexus during your absence. Events escalated quickly, but we believe it began with fire and hydroponics and left in the ar theft in the armory. Motivations for the uprising vary. Mob mentality was certainly a factor, but for the leaders, including your predecessor, former security director Sloan Kelly, it was a conscious betrayal. There have been perfunctory attempts to catalog and address the damages caused by Sloan's people during the uprising. 
Supplies stolen, equipment broken, things of that nature. But I was hoping the militia could step in and draw up an official report. It's imperative we know what we are working with and we are going to survive. Direct attack. Okay. And damage control. To that guy from Tehran, blah blah blah. Direct attack. I need my people focused on defending the station, not taking inventory. If you really need militia oversight, I'll get Sergeant Nails to look at it. Let's see, it was my understanding that exiles from more Calyx's people than Sloan's. Isn't he the one who started the mutiny? Call me. Kisses. Love, Kandros. And this is, uh, from Jeroen Tan to Turan, blah de blah Okay. Calyx Corvana Smith started it, but Sloan made her allegiances clear. I know she held you in high regard, but I hope you can be impartial when it comes to this task. Sloan, Kelly's not who I thought she was. There won't be a problem. Good. Then you won't object to stand, sending a small and discreet reconnaissance team to find out where Sloan and the exiles might have gone. When do we get colonial efforts up and running? And when we do, I mean. I don't want any surprises. Foreign report for recon team 232. Trail's cold. Found what looks like abandoned camps in the fire proof system, but no one's living in inhabitants or in graveyards. The conspirator Irida was among the dead, but not Sloan Kelly. Okay. Let's go back here. Never mind. How do you even... Oh, I guess you squeezed through there. Okay. Next. Who's on the list of people to talk to? What if they store oxygen in porous tissue, like Quiro's rockfish? I still reckon they had breather gear stowed in that armor. Perhaps both. Life is infinitely adaptable, as our expedition proves. Okay. Professor! Prof Professor! 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 You must be the Pathfinder. Hi. Wonderful. You and your Sam are exactly what we need. What the hell? That Thanks, guy's got a little hat. Mr. Professor Herrick, my colleagues and I will work with your Sam and the data you gather to solve Andromeda's scientific help. mysteries. I'm usually out in the field, but I wouldn't mind talking shop, uh, lab, you know. You are always welcome. Thank you. Not that we've had much to study with everyone cooped up for 14 months. But your data on the Scourge flows like poetry. Now we can better advise on repairing the damage it caused. And maybe Addison will give us a real workspace. Who can think with all this racket? Okay. Thank you guys for that, I guess. Speak with Kandros and Addison. And speak with Sam. Is this is this one of the two people over here? Myriad. Oh, hey, 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 hey. Shut up. Weird help. What's up? It's not right. It's not fair. What? What's wrong? What's up? Oh my, you're... So it's true. A Pathfinder has found us. There's I guess. hope at last. Okay, what's Maybe up? Maybe you could help. You're impartial. This whole thing has gotten so political. Oh, I don't want to talk my about husband, that. He's locked up and slated for exile. For a oh, I crime saw him. He didn't commit. I saw him in there. What was the crime? What exactly was he convicted of? They don't exile you for petty theft. Well, maybe this bunch would. They say it's murder. They're calling him the first murderer in Andromeda. But the dead man was his friend. He wouldn't have. There are witnesses and evidence, but it's all circumstantial. At worst, it was an accident. His name is Milken Rensis. He could give you the details if you were willing to speak with him. Please. Okay. I'd be happy to. Oh, thank you. I'm sure the jailer will allow you a visit. Please, tell Milken I love him. Okay, I'll tell Nilkin I love him. Nilkin! Let's have a conversation, man. Oh, it's over here. Nilkin! Sir! Sergeant! I need to talk to this man. Yep. Pathfinder Rider, here to see Nilkin Rensis. Ah, our murderer. Yep. Wife's here all the time. Guess she told you her sob story. Nilkin, you're moving up in the world. There's a Pathfinder wanted to chat with you. The Pathfinder, huh? They called in the big guns to exile Andromeda's first murderer. I love you. Okay, bye. Get in the fucking house! You're grounded. <laughs> <laughs> I'm here to take my base back. Uh-oh. Cutscene. What the fuck? Like the sun, always. I'll be doing the singing for you guys tonight. I have to.